Hi folks, back again, Bachelor of Chronicles number 167. Uh, I'm not sure if, if, if I'm going to be able to do it this trip, uh, although I might do it for the next segment, but I was going to do one on uh, who actually controls us, who actually are our bosses, who actually dictates what we do, who actually sets up policies, who actually sets up rules and things like that. Uh, yeah, I might do that after this, but here's the one I want to talk about now. You know, we shouldn't have a government that lies, period. You know, we, we I think most families, uh, when we grow up, one of the first things our parents tell us is you don't lie. You know, that's it. You just don't lie. Um, and surely we shouldn't have our government lying. Here's, here's this, this, this fellow, this, 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 uh, this happened in, in the Vietnam War, and he is now being awarded uh, a Medal of Honor. Forty-two years after the event happened, and the reason is is because he was in Laos, Laos, however you want to pronounce it, and this is where he ended up dying after saving three of his comrades. And I guess the point I'm trying to make is is that I can appreciate sometimes that we don't, that we, the government, we don't divulge things at the moment they're going to happen, you know, for obvious reasons. But one thing we shouldn't do is lie. You know, our parents uh, brought us up telling us not to lie. And who in the hell are these people in our government to lie? Lie to us, lie to the world. Uh, you know, we we say we're the greatest country around all this other BS. Well, you know, we're most likely a pretty good country. Uh, we have a hell of a lot of room for improvements. A lot of room. Uh, but one thing we surely shouldn't do as a country is lie. And this gentleman here who uh, died uh, 42 years ago, uh, now they're going to give him the uh, Medal of Honor. Who's going to be there? Well, seemingly he has three children. So, of course, his parents, I would imagine, possibly are deceased, and all the other people who loved him uh, are no longer here. And now we're going to recognize and honor him. And the reason we're doing it 42 years late is because we, the government, we are liars. And that should not be acceptable, period. Anyway, that's it. Thank you.